<coughs> okay, here we have a 2008 BMW Tourer 318 with an intermittent misfire. And we're going to see what the BMW software comes up with. We'll have a look at what fault codes are in there. It's just going through the control units now. Okay, so we're going to display the fault lists and see what's going on right we've got combustion misfire cylinder one so we're going to have a look at that and calculate the test plan and see what it wants us to do Okay, so we're going to continue with next. Okay, let's have a look at basic check. Right, it's going to start by checking the low pressure pump for this fault code. I can hear the pump running now on the car. Reading 5.6 bar, I'd say that's okay. No fault found. Let's go to the next one. Right, now it's going to ask, it's asking me, are the ignition calls one of the following numbers? And I've already checked them, and no, it's not. Next. Okay then, start the engine please. Okay, turn off. Ignition on. It's on. Right. Just checking the pressure drop off now to make sure there's no leaks on the system. Okay. Injector test being initialized. It's going to test the injectors now. Okay, start the engine.
So now testing all the injectors, you can hear the engine dipping. Right, it's firing the injectors now. You'll see the revs start to increase soon. And it will start to induce misfire. And you'll see the camera start to show because I'm leaning against the side of the car. Revs are increasing. Inducing misfire now in each of the cylinders, and that's why the camera's shaking because the car's rocking side to side. That's the software making those noises for the injectors. And now it will start to reduce the revs down towards idle again. And that will be the end of the injector test. Turn the engine off. Okay. Ignition on. Okay, start the engine again. Okay, switch it, switch it off. Ignition on. And there we go, it has condemned all fuel injectors and this is why it had an intermittent misfire. Thanks to Ryan Gold, we are now going to change the injectors and uh, that should be the end of this customer's issues. Thank you.